So, everyone, welcome back to the final video. Well, pretty much the final video. It's the velocity of Tynos we're going to be doing today. And it is the main loss level. It's not the final, final level. But it's pretty much the, the, the one second to the end, pretty much. So, um, what we're going to do is take you through the level, take, take you through the secrets as well. And yeah, I hope you enjoy this. Just bear bear with me though. It is difficult. There are a lot of puzzles around and it doesn't get completed in ten minutes. It will take some time. But as you've seen there, I've just pulled that switch down. And then we're gonna really look at here. And then what we're gonna do is just do a range up over to that block over here and again over to the end and then we're going to collect that safe game crystal and the rocket so so once we've done that we're then just going to jump down uh, put ourselves down here <laughs> and then have a quick look and see what's anything in here not a lot there we're going to ignore that so next thing what we need to do is just go back up the ladder again we haven't quite finished up there yet so we're just going to make our way back up So, as you can see down there, that's probably where we need to go. We're going to lower ourselves down here. Sorry, what am I doing? It's where I've just come from. Apologies. Okay, sorry. Yes, we do. We go in here. Right, so through the door we go. on the floor here, some sort of key, or couldn't see what that is, the Ulai key, which I believe, I think we saw that door didn't we, I think the door is over here somewhere, here it is here, I'm guessing it goes in here, here we go, And then through the gates we go. Let's have a quick look down here, see if there's anything to get. Nope, nothing here. Let go of that flare in case we need to do a jump and won't make it. She's trying to throw a flare in the middle of the air. Okay, no, we'll be alright anyway, so that's fine. Okay, so we just shimmy to the left here. And down we go. I'm putting up a flare on here just in case there's anything. Nope. Okay, fine. Let's go through here. There's a lever there that we've got to push. Pull down rather. Pull that down. And it just opens up the gate there, so that's fine. So let's go out onto the platform and another lever. We'll pull that one down as well. Not quite sure what that did, but never mind. Okay, so let's just go straight across here. Looks like we just got a slide down here. And down here. 
and there's another lever. There's quite a few levers early on in this level. Okay, interesting. Let's come out here. I'm wondering if the... Well, it's been altered. It's over here. I wonder. In here. Yes, it has. Yes, it's been changed in here. Let's just go up this, this ladder here. I wonder if there's some sort of puzzle here, we haven't got a threshold with these. What we're going to do is to realise that actually... I've got a feeling that there is a sequence to this. Okay, I'm just going to try and work this out. What I'm going to do first of all is just save it first of all because we've got semi Sega crystals to use up here, so we might as well use them. So there we go. Okay, so what we need to do is make sure number three and number four are switched off. So that's number three and number four, leaving number one, two, and five. As on. Once we've done that, we're going to be approaching the first secret. And the first secret is basically you've got to go, go jump over here, pick up the side game crystal. This is random. Jump up here and then up here again. Gonna get something a bit better out as well. We're looking at the, uh, the MP5, I think it's a decent gun to use. And then we're gonna do a running jump over to here. Put up here. Gonna come up here. And then do jump just over here and then take out the wasp there go to the back there and then jump level boss take it out there okay so the next thing to do is to jump to platform, invisible platform which will be in the middle. Now be about here. We'll just take them two out there. And then another jump to here. The cat the wasp there. And then we can jump to there, which would be a safe thing to do, I suppose. Just do a jump to here. Okay, that wasp there. I'm gonna fire a grenade in here. That'll work. We're going to do another jump here onto the invisible platform and then put the flare on here and then we're going to do another jump over to here and here is that first secret 
Okay, what we're going to do here is just save it quickly. Lots of save game crystals to use here. Just save it here. Okay, so now we're done in here, we can now go back and try and get away from this boss. He's annoying me. Don't come near me, wasp. Just come down here. Let's get the pistols out of here and finish this one off. There you go. Done. Right, so we now need to go back over here. Back over where we came from. Get the UVs out as well, sink a bit more, a bit more powerful. Jump up here and then jump up again. And then do a running jump across. That would be a wasp, wouldn't there? Great. Okay, and we can just put ourselves down here. And then there is a small mini pack just in here. Come must be. Leave it out, will ya? Hopefully it doesn't decide to follow me through as well. Let's go through here. Hopefully it leaves me alone. Don't go following me. Oh, I knew it. So, I'm going to come through to the next part here, we're going to use the rocket launcher here, because there is a couple of beasts that we're going to try and take out. The best way of doing these is to, to keep doing this, basically, to keep dodging their bullets. Uh, I'll try using the grenade launcher here. So that's defeated those now, so let's use the shotgun now. I'm guessing that's gonna go on in a minute. Let's check see what's in there, nothing there. Okay, nothing there either, so we can move now through here. There we go, just as I expected. So we just wait for the flame to go. And there we are. Okay. Oh, I heard something. Let's just make our way up here, and then, oh god, another wasp, damn wasps. Okay, make our way up here, let's have a look, see what we've got up here. We don't want to get too near that, because I think that kills us. going to be the last part here that we need to get to. So what we're going to do is just leave that for the moment. We're going to check out the other parts of this, of this bit.
throw this around here. Okay, so we've got a switch to pull. Opens up the gate. Great, okay, we've got another one of these to kill off. Use a rocket launcher here again. And then we'll just finish him off with a Desert Eagle, I think. There's a couple of other beasts around. Two more in there. No doubt they will appear at some point. Much in here. Have released them. Okay, so let's get out and use these, I think. Got a few grenade launchers which we're going to use, so try that on these. him off. Okay, let's just, just use a uh, small woody pack here, Got loads of them. And then we'll have a quick look in here, see if there's anything for us. A lever, great. Pull that down. And then we'll just go and check the whole one as well. Not much there. Okay. I think we can start working our way up, which will require us to jump on this block here and then jumping up there. And we just need to do a running jump over here. And then we'll just crawl underneath here. We've got to be careful here. We've got some flames here. It's going to leave the, the button down. Okay, we can come up. I'm also going to save it here as well. So we just want to get to the left here as much as we can and then jump here and then just move underneath here to this lever and pull that lever down. So we didn't want to do a running jump over to here to try and get that ammo that's in here. Should we be able to do that. Collect it there. down and then just go along to the end here and pull this switch down. And just jump up here and under here we go. Another switch here. Now I just need to make our way down to the end here. Not about that though. I think we 
just uh, okay. Now we just need to move over there, don't we? down to here. Down here. And then again. And then down here. Okay, so now we've got the other flat out. We can now do Actually, I think we need. So we need to mess that up, haven't I? Step again. I will do this. Right. Turn around. Jump up here. around again and then pull up here not much we can do with this here just pull this and we're going to go down that does that so I wonder if do we need to pull this one again may need to. Okay, let's see what this does now. I like it's done too much. We may need to go up again and then re pull one of the switches that are already up there. Let's have a look. I'm not quite sure exactly what one it is at the moment. But let's start with this one in here and let's see if it has any effect on some of those ledges that have been released. So let's have a look. That looks better. I wonder if we need to do the same in here. See what's done here. <clears throat> if anything, okay. don't seem that's too much done. Let's just put ourselves down here. Not a lot there. Let's do a running jump over to here. And let's see if we can try. Keep it here as well. Might as well. We just need to have a bit of a gap here, like that, there you go. But the problem is, oh no, there is no problem, let's jump up here. Okay, so we just monkey swing along here.
him right to the end. There we go. That's done that there. Great. Did everything then? Doors oh. open. Watching that water either. Got just a bit of health there, I'm just gonna use a large medipack. And let's go through here. I feel like something's gonna happen. Let's go up the ladder here then. And then to the left here. Down here we go, Let's put a flare on. There. Okay, that just takes us back around here. Fine. So we do need to do something more here. Randomly jumpers. Okay. Do take a bit of damage those things, don't they? Right, so we need to go into the opposite corner. Get up, please. Oh. Right into this corner here. I think it is, yep. Yeah. We've got the key. Fine. That's probably to use in that. That, uh, that, that socket that we just, that keyhole that we just come across. I guess that's where that's got to go. Just, right, here we go. Oh. And then we're going to use a really grenade launcher for these. So we're happy with covered of all the areas here. We can now look at the 
completing this part. Let's go back up the ladder. go down right so let's put in the key here that we picked up the UI key this goes in here and I've got no idea what the hell that just did but it must have done something Let's have a quick look down here. We have got one. There's four of these we've got to collect. It's quite surprising that we didn't pick one up. Maybe we did miss something here. Okay, so let's save it here. Totally sorry, but there was secret number two that we actually missed. And remembering now it's actually a timed switch. So I'm sorry I've got to take you back through some of this, but we're basically just going to go back and there's a switch that we pulled. I'll show you where it is. Basically, it's a timed switch. So we need to hurry up and do this. And I completely just didn't know it was. Um, I'll show you exactly which one, but we need to just backtrack slightly. Um, this won't take long, this will only be another couple of extra minutes. I'll show you exactly where, so we just need to make our way back up here. Um, just up here. Back up here. Up here again. Running jump across to the other platform. And then we just need to jump up here. And then this switch here, this is the one that's timed and I didn't realise. But it is. I'm just going to pull that down. This is a timed door. We really need to get a move on. Okay, so we're going to come down here. We're going to just go over to here, and again we go, okay, and now we need to leg it, we need to go, to make sure you don't get stopped in the water either, just go, keep going, up the ladder. And we're going to be going near where we started, ish. Not quite, but right at the beginning, obviously. But you'll find out. You'll see where. <clears throat> we need to drop down here, and then we need to go again. Make our way around. stairs here around here and the way around here back here back through the flames here be careful with these and then all the way down here down here health there but never mind we just need to get in here before it closes on us there we go and that is the secret so apologies 
we had to backtrack. But there you have it. So pull that switch down. Great, that looks a suit. Great. Clever, wasn't it? I didn't realise I was going to do that. Anyway, so that is that. So now we can continue on with the rest of the level. I don't think there's much more here. Just get back up and on. Okay. Up here. Up here. And then up. here back through the flames and then we can continue on with the next part that is this part here I'm gonna save it here might as well, while well, we've got 39 save game crystals. Okay, so we can proceed into here now. We're going to do a jump to the right. I'm just going to keep coming. Just keep coming <coughs> and going through here, through the quicksand. Might do actually, it's just give myself a bit of a boost. Still jump. Might as well. Gets me there a bit quicker. Let's just keep going up here. Don't worry if she starts to go down and down and down. Just keep going. Finally, you keep going, she will be fine. So we just keep going. And then to the right hand to the well cove. We to go into here. And up we go. So part of the next secret is to pull a switch, which is here and I'll show you. So we need to do a running jump. No, it would be right with a standing jump onto this ledge here. And I'm going to jump over to there. And then we should be able to pull up here. And there's a switch just down here. And a small midi pack. We just need to pull here this one. And that's part of the next secret. So that block is basically where the, the main part is. And I'll show you that in a second. So we just need to now work our way back. wasps to take out. I'm just going to go up here. There's another one. Or is it just one? Maybe it's just one. It might have just been one. 
I'm just gonna make sure I've got some extra health here as well. Let's follow this all the way around here. And then we need to take this item in here. But this is going to cause some issues when we take it. It's gonna be a lot of fallen sort of um, from the ceiling. Ceiling's gonna come down. So I'm just gonna save it here. Might as well. So this thing's gonna start falling down. So what we do is we slowly just approach, approach each part. So the ceiling just slowly comes down in front of us. We don't take any damage and we don't die. Just like that. here to deal with. And there's a small midi pack. Just oh not a small midi pack, so there's an eagle. I come back here. Okay, so put the first one there like that. And then the second one. And then we'll pull the lever here as well. At the end. Okay, so let's climb up the ladder here. And hopefully, we should be back to where the main part is. Hopefully. A quick look around us. Interesting. What's in here? See what the point of that was. Maybe it's just to confuse people, maybe. But anyway, as you can see, there is nothing there. Okay, so. Let's follow all this round. Interesting. So, I pulled that lever earlier, 
and basically what that did is that moved the block down here, this block here. So now what we need to do is push this, get it towards the ladder. Shit here. to the top. And then there will be these flames will start to come alive. Go. And there you go. There is the secret. We just crawl under here. Grab that save game crystal. And the large medi pack. Save it here as well. Why not? We're just going to come down the ladder here and then basically going to go back up the stairs here. So, back up the stairs, back up to where the yellow beam is, and in this case, what we'll do next is take the right fork. Go right down here into here. So you'll notice as well there are some blades to avoid. To avoid them like that, and we'll just swim through here, swim up here, all the way to the edge, duck down. So we'll just swim along here, and then there's a small mini pack in the water here. puzzle, what we need to do is take the left fork. I thought I was going to lose some health then. Never mind, didn't. And then get some air. Down there we go. Pull the switch. And then what we'll do is come out of here. And then we need to go into the right fork. It is a time switch, so we need to be fairly quick. So then we just come up here. And then right at the top there, there's some air for us. Make sure we get the full air back. And put a flare on as well. We need to go into the right here. with some Uzi clips and then what we'll do is we'll go back got lost of health there, never mind let's come back up here I'm actually going to save it here might as well save it before we die there's some more ammo to collect, I'm gonna collect that now. Like so, and then there is a lever to pull here. We're gonna pull that. 
and then I'm hoping can I bring that? No, we not. I'm gonna have to go back on that. Down here and then through here. All the way in here. No. And here is the next mask. Now if we just jump over here. We've got to switch it. Okay, so need to go back into the water again and uh, try and get through here that, and then follow it all the way through there's another lever on the left here oh, just down here so let's pull that and then go backwards and then through the little alcove here. There's some movie clips there, I think it is. And then what we do is go into the bottom one here. And then we should be able to just follow this through. I think I'm going to have enough energy. Yeah, well, just about have enough there. So we just follow this down under here, going up, and there's some area there at the top. And then pull up here. And then here we have a switch, which I guess is going to make the floor go downwards for us. Yep. It's going to open up, and here we are. So this is familiar should be familiar and we're back here that is the second mask that we've collected now so now we move on to the third one we're going to come back up to where the beam is here and this, this, uh, this part we're going to take the left fork and just before we do that we're going to save it again We just need to come all the way down here and in the left here, right, left, left. And there's some ammo, so this is a maze, it's pretty difficult. Um, so you've got to follow everything I do. You come back around here, do a right, down here, do a left, next left, to the end here, do a right. Almost like wasps, a wasp here, right. So this is quite difficult. Um, there's so many different ways you can go, so you just gotta follow me as I'm doing this. Okay, so I get the ammo here. Once we've uh, collected the ammo, come back, do a left, do a right, left, left. Right here to the end. Right here. Go down the end. Left here and then there's some shotgun shells. And diagonal cross. We need to do a right here. Left. Left again. Diagonal cross. Do a right. Do a left, another left. Just went past the bit that we should have gone to the left in here, isn't it? Eventually, we should come out here. Now there are some other items 
you can pick up. I think there's a grenade that I've missed. But I don't need the ammo. Being myself up here, I don't need the ammo. Though, but you can find them in there. Okay, so we're just going to come up here. And then you'll see here, there's going to be some of these rolling spikes. The best way to to dodge these. So right there like that. Left the end. I guess the next lot are going to come as well. That. And there we go. And then come up to the top here. And we've got another mask. So we'll just jump over there like that. We're into the door. I'm gonna go backwards just in case there's a rough landing here. No, oh, no, it's water. Fine. And we'll just swim along here. And then up here. And again, this is familiar territory to everybody. Come out to where the main part is. Here we go. So that is the third mask. And just to confirm, I've got three. There are, there's three. Okay, so this is the final mask that we need to get now. And we need to go into the barn that we haven't been down. That's the, the one furthest down to us. So let's go through here. And then, as always, what I'll do is, before I do this, I'll just save it again as well. Okay, so there's a map up there, which tells you what platforms to go onto. I already know, so just follow this. So you go to the nearest one, the furthest one towards the wall, and then up into this one over, over here. There's a range I'm over. Then, we then need to do is make sure you're coming up here. You're doing a backflip back on the other platform. Okay, and then you do that. That's the quickest way of doing dealing with it. We just pull ourselves down to here. We've got some fire breathing dragons here. Just want to just make sure come off there. And down there, so we need to do the same with this here. I suspect what I could do actually is do a rain jump over to there. Would be the easiest thing to do. Like that, yeah. Rather than going into the second platform. Okay, so pull that lever down. Hopefully, that should open the gate. It doesn't. Great. Oh, that's just stopped the third guy, the third dragon, from actually doing anything, which is. I think that's probably what was needed actually. Okay, interesting. Now I'm just going to save it again. Might as well. Let that do its thing. We just need to do a rain jump over to here. Back off here. Come up, he's probably finished his flame by now. Let's time that well. But here we go. As we come through, just be careful of this here. I'm gonna wait for it to completely go over there. There we are. Just dodge that. That can catch a lot of people out. And um, so we get the out oh, the last mask. And then we should be able to just come all the way through here. And again, should bring us down to 
where we are very familiar with. So we're back out here. And we're back out to this main part here. So let's put all the masks in here. And second one. completing this level, this very difficult level by the way, shall I say. And there's the beams gone. So now we should be able to come down here. And then slide down and that should be the end of the level. And there you are. That is the lost city of Tyno. We hope you've all enjoyed this. Very difficult level, yes. Roll on to roll on the next level, it is the boss level. So we'll see you there in the final level and I'll be doing the bonus level as well because we've got all the secrets as well. So I'll be doing that bonus level as well. So we will see you there. Don't forget to like and subscribe.